Hello, hello, my friends. Welcome back to Learning with Miss G. Today is another fun winter story. We're going to read a fun story called The Mitten. It's written by Jane Brett. Are you ready? Let's read. The Mitten. A Ukrainian folktale adapted and illustrated by Jane Brett. Once there was a boy named Nicky. He wanted mittens as white as snow. If you drop a white mitten in the snow, it'll be hard to find, his grandmother told him. But Nicky wanted snow white mittens, so much that Baba made them for him. When she finished knitting, Nicky put on the mittens and went out to play. It wasn't long before one mitten fell off. A little mole found it and crawled inside. It was just the right size, so he decided to stay. A rabbit came hopping by. He wiggled in next to the mole. A hedgehog wanted to get warm. The mole and the rabbit made room for him. The owl didn't want to be left out, so the mole, the rabbit, and the hedgehog had to move over. The little mitten was getting very crowded. There's several animals in the mitten now. A badger looked out of his house and saw the mitten. He climbed right in. It started to snow, so a fox pushed his way in and made himself right at home. Then a big bear sniffed at the mitten. The animals were packed in tight, but the bear didn't care. He crawled in anyway. The mitten was getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Then a tiny mouse squeezed in and perched herself on the big bear's nose. The mouse's whiskers tickle the bear's nose. Ah, 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 shoo! The bear sneezed. All of the animals flew out of the mitten. Nicky saw his mitten sail up into the air. From the window, Baba watched Nicky catch his mitten. See, Baba, he called to her. I have both my mittens, and Baba smiled. And that's the end of the mitten. I hope you enjoyed that story. I enjoyed reading it to you. If you liked it, like the video and subscribe to my channel. That way you won't ever miss another story that Miss G has to read to you, all of my friends. Let's sing the goodbye song, and I'll see you next time. It's time to say goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Wave your hands. Did you wave? Wink your eye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, friends. I will see you next time right here in Learning with Miss G. Bye.